Hi everyone, it's Saturday and such a beautiful day here in Arizona. It feels like spring. I know it's not, but boy does it feel like it. Just gorgeous in the 70s. There's a couple of my kitty cats out walking around on my porch. <laughs> so I just love the wreath. It just looks so pretty and all of these flowers just really make me smile. And uh, my flowers, my flowering bushes are actually starting to come back. They did get frost damage this year, but they're coming back. A little view of my neighborhood, and everybody's been out working in the yard today. There's my shadow. <laughs> I did all my yard work yesterday and got all my bushes trimmed up and the dead off of them from frost damage. And everything looks so pretty, and I'm just having... A beautiful day today. There's those little flags that I ordered through Amazon. That first one says, Hello, Spring. I know it's not spring, but I just wanted to go ahead and put it up anyways. And uh, it's really pretty. And here's the second one. And it just says, Welcome. And I really love these flags. They each have a little bit of the buffalo check on them, like they're on my pillows. And I think I want to go to the Goodwill and see if I can find a couple of pink pillows to put on my porch for spring. I think I'm going to uh, add a little uh, pink this year. So I've just been doing little odds and ends in my house today. Switched out my plates and my plate holder here in my living room. And uh, I don't like the one on the top, but the bottom three are all hand-painted plates with little cutouts for handles. And they're all from Bavaria. And I would like to find one more. Aren't they pretty? So uh, that one there, uh, the second from the bottom, is the recent one I found. All three of them were finds from Goodwill. So now I just need to find one more for the top to match them. But they are gorgeous. So here on my coffee table in my living room, I have these blue and white plates that I think are absolutely beautiful. And I've been wanting to incorporate a little of this china blue color in with my red walls. Now this is a plate from England uh, by Spode and I just think it's so pretty. It's actually a picture of Italy and I've been there. <laughs> and uh, down here this little very unusual plate is a plate hand painted from Germany. Now I'm out on my patio, you're going to hear traffic. And uh, that was given to me by a very, very dear friend that passed a few years ago. And it's just gorgeous. Now here is that planter that I bought over at the Goodwill, the blue and white one. And I think it all reflects so pretty on top of that mirror. I just love that mirror. And I put some red roses in there. And what do you think with the red walls? I'm not going to do a lot of blue, but there's my red walls. And not my entire living room is red. Just a couple of the walls are accented in red. Now here on my dining room table, I put my silver centerpiece there my tray and my tea and coffee set with my sugar and creamer and it's so funny because my friend Jody over at uh, Jody at Southern Seasons had done the same thing isn't that funny put some little red roses in it and I just needed to switch things up just a little bit you know you get tired of the same thing but I think that came out really nice so do you remember those uh, topiaries that I found at Goodwill? And uh, they came in a container that looked like it was cement, just a drab gray. And I kind of wanted to paint them like a terracotta pot color. So I mixed those three paints together and I just painted them up. And uh, yeah, I think it did come out looking like a terracotta pot. And uh, Yep, there's one of them. Yeah, that looks really nice. That's going to actually go in my uh, den that I am switching around a little bit too. 
So this is how the pots came out, and I just dabbed a little bit of the yellow over it. And I'm going to put a little moss on it. So here's this little bag of moss that I had, and I don't want a lot on. I'm just going to take out a couple little strands, hot glue it on in a few little places, and then I'll probably remove most of it. So you've got to watch your fingers. <laughs> These little topiaries I found, I think they were about $6 each. And they're really pretty, except I just didn't like the color of them. So when I get these done, they're going to go out in the den that I'm going to redecorate a little bit in the Tuscan theme. So that looks really pretty. So while I'm out in the kitchen, I decided to clean the dishwasher. Now it's getting a buildup of that nasty white scale. I uh, looked at it and there's no particles laying in there. I mean, the dishes come out clean. They just come out coated in that white, nasty coating. So I'm going to add some vinegar and run a really hot uh, rinse cycle in there and clean that out. And uh, hopefully my dishes won't come out coated anymore. Sears man came out to fix my washing machine today. And guess what? It's broke. So actually what he found out is what I thought it was, that little drain is cracked and not working properly. So it's going to take about a week and a half. So I'll go ahead and fix my dishwasher. Looks like my package is here. I ordered a little. Uh, it's a table runner, St. Patty's Day, for my kitchen. I'm not going to do a lot, but I just want to decorate my table a little bit. So, here he comes. So, yay, here it is. It's my table runner. Let's open it up and see what it looks like. So, here's my new St. Patty's Day table runner. Isn't that cute? It looks like burlap here at the bottom, and it just says Lucky. And then it has a gnome there with a, not a four-leaf clover. It should be a four-leaf, but it's a three. And then it has the buffalo check. I think that is so cute. And I can't wait to get that on my table next month. So we see these four biplanes flying up in the sky right by us. They must be having some kind of a air show coming out of Falcon Field. That's not too far from us. So that was really, really cool to see. I wish I could have got them closer up. It's not often you get to see the biplanes flying around. Boy, that was neat. So here's where I added those little topiaries out here in the den. And this was a picture I actually took down from the living room and thought, since I'm decorating Tuscan, it just suits the space. So I think that looks really pretty. And once I get this room all thrown together, I'll show you a little bit more. But I have decided to go back and do a little Tuscan. Well, my sweet friends, that's about all I have for you today. So I wish you all well, and I'll see you soon. Love you guys. Bye for now.